Okay guys, welcome back. We're going to be playing a game called Dreamtail. This is set after the pacifist run, after you win. Because Greater Dog keeps jumping on me and Joy knocking me out, so we're going to try this. I can move. I thought we needed a nice channel game, to be perfectly honest. Wait. Is it Z to interact? It's a clothes drawer. There are many clean, striped shirts. Kids seem to get back to sleep. It's a beautiful night outside. It's just a lamp. There's absolutely nothing to do in this game except for explore. Just chill out. It's a lovely flower finally growing with a little help. Can I turn on the light? No. Can I jump? No. It's Undertale. Of course I can't jump. Toriel's room. It's locked. It's a lovely yellow flower. It's a lovely red flower. <laughs> yeah, this is not the official game, obviously, but... Torio gave you this weird-looking stuffed animal, but she uses it more than you do. Aww. Go on the best mall. It's a basket of shirts, all with the same pattern. Fashion! This room is this. Room under renovations. That's right. All we're here to do is explore, and this is her house in the upper world. Almost all of these books are new surface literature. Should we go down? Let's go around first. I'm sorry if a teeny tiny bit of the screen is cut off. It's a glowing mushroom from the underground. Glowing mushroom from the underground. What's the Z coming from? Here he is, next to Luke. Ooh. Oh, hi, Frisk. I was just sleeping here, outside your house. But then I went and stepped on the underside of your shoes. I'm so, so sorry. Um, having trouble sleeping? You can hang out here with me if you want to, or not. Why doesn't next to Luke come inside? <laughs> this flower after I bang into the wall. <laughs> Face particularly lovely tulips. Okay, I guess we'll check out the basement before we go water mom. Goat mommy sleeping. I get caught on more stuff in this game. Under construction. Hi, Birdie! Duck is happy to see you! Or maybe it's just doing a little dance. A pair of glowing mushrooms from the underground. Aww, Goat Mom brought all the best stuff. It's so heavy! Oh. <gasps> ah! It's a hiss. Hey, be careful carrying that. This is really important to her. mushroom from the underground. <laughs> Should we just set it down back here? Glowing mushroom from the underground. Oh, play music, please. Oh, this old statue. Looks like someone finally selfish it from the underground. Aww. 
Looks like he's all tuckered out. Okay, if we're, go we're going with Sans sleep. If Sans is here, where's Pappy? Aw, oh, and we're living with Sans! Oh, that's awesome. So we're living with Sans and Bluki and Goat Mom, Goat Mom, Best Mom. These are the same dusty books from Toriel's house in the ruins. Ah yes, yeah, 72 uses for snails, a classic. Tools are finally getting some use. Your place at the table. Toriel usually sits here at dinner time. And this is all about just exploring the house. This is nothing else to do. Flower had a seen better days. Well, some things never change. What is this? You pick up the umbrella. You don't open it, though. No bad luck for you. Oh, can we take that back downstairs? It's like Torio fell asleep while reading. Again. Can we take that back downstairs? Just to sink. Faded ribbon has been left out. You equip the faded ribbon. Few around, Torio is happily baking pies every day. It's a brand new stove made right here on the surface. But Toriel still just cooks everything with fire magic. Shiny new fridge. Okay, let's go see if I can give the... Oh! Oh my gosh, she's awake! Oh, hello, little one. When you are ready to say goodnight, let Toriel know. Hey, Mom. I I'm gonna go downstairs and play with the statue you probably don't want me to play with. Try not to break it. Is the duck crying now? The duck is crying because he missed you so much. I'm here! Oh my god, this game got sad! Place the umbrella atop the statue. Yes! <laughs> Inside the statue, music box begins to play. Did we wake him up? Will Ducky be happy? Aw, oh, looks like he's all tuckered out. Oh, hey kid. Hey. How you doing there, buddy? Been a while, huh? Yeah. Sorry we haven't been around too much lately. We just keep finding more and more weird junk down there. But hey, don't worry. We'll be done before you know it. Okay, he's sparkling, so I guess he has more to say. I'll admit, it has been pretty exhausting work. But that's alright. Bro is happy. I'm happy. Helping monsters. Jeez. You're kind of all about that stuff, right, kid? Okay, more sparkles. On our last trip, we picked up this old rock for your mom. She doesn't know we found it yet, so don't go ruining the surprise. Guess my bro already headed back to the new snow den for the night. We'll be on the surface for a few days before we go back underground. Hey, wait a minute. Isn't it past your bedtime? Eh, don't worry. I won't tell. More sparkles! This <laughs> is the most I've ever seen them. Talk! Well, I'm going to get some fresh air. You're so awake. Feel free to come join me. Okay. 
Please don't cry, little ducky. Duck is crying because he missed you so much. Well, come with me. Come with me, little ducky. So we're gonna meet Sans outside. They said this was a tiny, quick game. They lied. Glad you can make it. Did you know Grilby's daughter opened up her own late night place nearby? I was thinking we could head to town and drop by. Sound good? Yes! Cool. Just follow my lead. I know a shortcut. Oh my god, they so lied. Look how awesome this game is! <laughs> I'm talking to everyone! Hey, hey! You're the kid who remembered my name! Honey, please, I have to call you back. There's a lot of yelling going on in here. It's so swoopy! Give me a hug! Did you hear? I finally changed my name to Jimmy Hot Pants. I will be Ice Wolf no longer! Ice does not define me! Good for you, baby. It really is true! Every dog gets his day! Dude! Miss you! Hello, little one! Have you been faring well? Oh my god, I'm faring joke. Slime kids are napping on some bar stools. You wonder what two children are doing at a bar in the middle of the night. Honestly, kids these days! This table seems to make a nice roost. Yes, yes, Miss Fuku! I'll have it all cleaned up soon! Named her Fuku after the poisonous fish? Oh, okay. Oh! Hey, Frisk! Um... Looks like Hunty is up for the count. Exactly what do they serve in this bar? Why have I been allowed to come in? Ah, I can't go back. I can't go back here? It's livelier than I expected tonight. Fuku really brings in quite the nightlife crowd. Normally, I try to get here earlier in the evening. Always fun to play cards with the wolves and pups, but they left already. It's a real doggone shame. <laughs> to run into us like this. She's her. She'll be fine in the morning. She's flat out drunk. If you poke her side, she groans incoherently. If you poke her side, she groans incoherently. You let all my friends get drunk. Where did they come from? My hat is bigger than your hat. It's not. It's true. It's not! This continues for some time. Oh my god. Okay, can I go back out? You can't go through the fire exit because you're not made of fire. This game has all the bad jokes. Do you know the full name of this bar is Fuku's Midnight Girl and Magical Boat Storage? It's a perfect solution for hard-working single witches like me. Dead. What? You thought you were gonna make it through the night without some comedy gold? I haven't seen it yet. <laughs> you, uh, you still remember it, right? Um, no. Pat Jimmy on the head. Good doggo! Hello, sweetheart! Did I lose you? This is so cool. Admittedly, 
This is kind of my fault. This seems to happen every time she wears that armor. She's excitable like that. Uh... I'm not allowed to drink. Ah! Why does this keep happening? Well, if you didn't troll on the floor, maybe it wouldn't. He said, I can't get back to there. And I can't get to that book. Can I go out? Are you leaving a ring? You hardly sat down. Well, at least grab a bite to eat before you go home. It'll help you get some sleep. I'm trying to sit down. I can't. I only asked her to try it on for, uh... Never mind the reason! Unimportant! Hey! Don't look at me like that! I just think it really brings all her inner, um... Tramp. My armor is so hot! What?! Fisk! Really now! Don't mind her! <laughs> like, really, really, really hot! Undine, please! Okay, so how do I talk to... Lady of the house. Don't let your guard down. I'm a generous guy. What does that mean? I can't get back here. Oh my god, this game will never end because I never got to sit down to eat. I have to wonder what good old Gurley is up to these days. He got out of the restaurant business right away. And never looked back. Guess I'm glad the acorn didn't fall from from the tree. You poker side, you're pressing to her. Like. How do I order anything to eat? I can't get to talk to her. Fuku eyes. The couple wearily. She is clearly the hottest woman in the bar tonight. <laughs> you think it's hot too, right, Frisk? D -d Don't I encourage her. Yeah, it's hot. <laughs> I guess we'll be here until the sun comes up. Don't worry about Undine. I'll get her home safe. My friend said such a great flipping example. Hey, Fuku, can I get another round? Well, enjoy yourself, kid. You brought me to a bar, you two fists. N Nighty night, Frisk. Oh god, I'm going home. Oh, going home? They definitely should get some sleep before school starts. In fact, they probably didn't really need to come to a bar at all. Oops. Good night, Fris. Sweet dreams. Why can't I leave? Hey, my friends took me to a bar. You're still awake? I hope you aren't getting sick. No, my friends were doofuses and they drove me to a bar because that would be an awesome idea. I think I'll see if Sans is downstairs and then I'll go to bed. Does he like never sleep? Maybe Mr. Ducky will go to the bar. Please stop crying, Mr. Ducky. Why can't I give him the faded ribbon? That should make him happy. 
There's a lone key sitting underneath the bench. You got the abandoned key. So what does the abandoned key go to? Oh, maybe to Mommy's room. Shut up. <laughs> That's my go, Mommy! I'm allowed to call her wherever I want. That's my goat mommy. Goat mommy. Woo! That was... Oh my god, goat mommy's a bigger nerd than I am. It's Toriel's diary. You read the open passage. Oh no. She's writing her own material now. <laughs> Toriel's writing chair. It's small and cramped, but she swears it helps her stay focused. Oh my god! Here, you're always safe from nightmares. It's like Pokemon City in this room! A bed fit for a crane, and apparently her royal subjects. Um, I ain't touching that one. One of Toriel's royal subjects. This is Archduke Advent Chesticar the 567th. <laughs> One of Toriel's royal subjects, this is Baroness Regalia Petanita II. Royal subject has no fear of the darkness beyond the window. You peek inside. Goodness gracious! It's Toriel Sotchor. How racy. Really now? Who needs this many socks? Bookshelf has recently been stocked with new surface literature. Texts about surface and subterranean plants alike now fill with skulls. Can I get behind the bed? Steadily and with a little love, it's growing to new heights. Wait a minute. You removed the price tag hooked through the wax leaf. <laughs> I love my mommy. She best mommy. Everyone's favorite to sundry plant. Sundry plant? Royal subject is a friend to all, even you, Prickly. Did you just call me Prickly? Nothing but emptied snail shells in here. Mommy's been snacking at night. Wait, did that picture just go back into co Okay. It must have been bleed over. Room under renovations. I'm ready for a nap. These human novels are truly quite charming. I couldn't put this one down for so long that I must have dozed off. Toriel gazes down at you. Oh! That ribbon! You know, it looks lovely on you. Sometimes, I can see so much of them in you. It's fine, Frisk. I know we've talked about this already. Watching you grow up here, on the surface, well... You'll have to forgive this silly old lady for wondering how things might have been. But, you know better than I do. Ever since the beginning, you've spent each and every day moving forwards. I see you smile, and I feel so hopeful about our future here. Because I see you do it. I know deep down I can too. You and all your wonderful friends, human and monster alike, will keep making the best of this beautiful world for as long as we can. Look at me, going on and on. This is hardly good material for a bedtime story. All right, my sweet child. It's awfully late, you know. I know, I was at all bored, Mom! Let's both read a nice story and have some pleasant dreams of her own. Oh my god, she's gonna read me a story? Oh my god, best go um ever! I love her so much. Can I get out of bed and go with my mommy? That was 
was so much fun! Oh my god, that was so much fun! So there you go, guys. There is Dream Tale. They said it was a short little um, game that would take only about 10 minutes or 20. We took a little over 25. And I think we pretty much poked at everything we could. So that was so much fun. If you like what you see, like, comment, subscribe, and I'll give you a link over to this. See you guys later. Bye-bye.